Hey everybody, I'm Johnny Lilto, and we are back playing more Amnesia Machine for Pigs. Uh, so I just noticed that in this area here, right next to the little pipe thing, there's these. So I actually already grabbed one, stuck it in here, and moved it over, but, uh, yeah. I figured I'd just show you guys where it is, just in case you're going to be looking at this for a solution yourself. Because you should play this. You should definitely play this. It is good. So yeah, showed up here. Already brought one in, put one in. And now this is beeping, so I can go like this. I right, smart. That's closing. So is that. I'm gonna take the high ground, I think. Uh, shoot. Come on. Uh. Okay, so I guess I take this. Oh, and this is my acid stuff. So I move. I don't like that at all. Okay. Okay, come on. Hmm. Now what? Just... Break it? Force? Force is always good. No? No? That's not... Uh... Come on. Come on. Why aren't you working? You're supposed to... Okay. Well, now what? Is there something else I need to do? Uh, let's check the notes. A heady brew. Out of the compound, it hisses and steams in its container like some living things thing. A witch's jelly to burn and corrode. The container is made from glass, a strange choice unless there is some particular reason why the metal that pervades everywhere else cannot be brought into contact with this so-called Compound X. I should investigate further for clues. Okay. G great. Now what? Uh... Is this? What? Is it just? Mm. No. Mm. Okay. Now, where do? Oh. Okay. Was it something to do with electricity? No? <sighs> oh, maybe this? Nope. Shoot, what was... what did that... note? Uh, I can't remember how to... Back. Uh, documents. Uh, delivery, journals, journal, final thoughts. Great, these... Nope, that's not the one. Oh, nah, come on. Chemical X. Uh, well, so, wait, what? I don't believe we're supposed to meet these damn schedules if even... Okay, I think that's from a while back. Wait. Uh... This is not helping. A warning, I think. Burning it does. Bleeding from each hole. No. Nope. That's not the one. Ah. Uh, more experiments with Compound X. Took the dog and... No. Nope. This is not well ordered. Uh, Symbol Compound. 
Brennan Burke Infusion Vive taped one part organic method dispersant that can be administered in first stop reassembly in building. The compound is unstable and highly light reactive. Once in the oh, okay. Do I not have my? Come on. Um, highly light reactive. That doesn't. Oh, this? This. There we go. Ow. Okay, good. I was afraid I was going to have to look something up for that. Seem to be getting dizzy. Down here, Daddy. Faster, faster. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. This is not a very good ladder. Like I think the ladder, um, walking from a dark descent was. A little bit more realistic and janky. This leaking world. All these nails and no wood. What kind of carpenter are you? That figure cannot help but ups open. That figure cannot help but opens its arms to you. Where is the strength in that? I think there should be a comma after help. Pretty sure. Grammar with Johnny Little Toe. Okay, what next? Looks like sewers. Not my favorite. Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> yes, that's where you fell from. You were probably well aware you were going to fall, considering... Okay. Apparently a lot of people fall and die here. Would a lot of people in general die here? Okay. Weird. October 22nd, 1899. Naturally, once bled, the product must be scalded, dehydrated, de oh sorry, dehaired, and scraped ready for gambroiling and evisceration. Evisceration. For this, we pass them through the steam reservoir, which is kept at a constant temperature by passing excess high-pressure venting from the engines via the boiler and series of large copper pipes into a sm uh, stone chamber that below the workhouse. Chamber just below the workhouse. At the center of the machine, there is a component that must be kept at a constantly low temperature, which controls operations of the processing of product through the system. Along this, refrigeration is of ut the utmost importance in retaining product quality, and this also requires heat to be removed from certain areas of the machine. Two problems are therefore combined into a single solution, the removal of heat from some areas and the requirements for increased heat in others. Conducting panels draw heat using the principles of conve uh, convection regulated by the boiler and sending freezing yeah, freezing air along one set of pipes in one direction, and superheated vapors in another. Righto. Okay. Isn't it dangerous allowing this filthy discharge to collect so close to the core? We can use the flow to drive the turbines. There will always be a torrent of excreta flooding through these tunnels. We can use this to supplement the steam production and ensure constancy. <laughs> God, the stench! This fecal matter is the true product of the age. This is disgusting. Oh! <laughs> I spoke too soon, they're here. I hate these things. I hate these things so very much. Oh god. 
What's over here? Something that's not them? Uh, sluice gate one. God, of course they're here. Of course. The one thing I didn't want to see come back is here. I'm guessing this is just new. No, this sluice gate, but yeah. I have to go towards the sound of. Pig. That's not a piggy, but just bubbling. Feces. Great. Nope. Oh god. What the hell? Let's go this way. Seems to be to the right. Or, nah, it seems to be that down there. Oh god. God, I hate this place. Oh god. Keep them away, keep them away, keep them away, keep them away. Just great. Okay. August 1st, 1899. Several of the older forms forms have breached their containment area and escaped into the sewers. Oh. They remind me of my limitations. This is no Kelm and I am no Elijah. At least, not quite yet. It is the heat generated from keeping the doorway between open that is to blame. We cannot simply pack them around with coolant as we do at the center where the doorway is. The later versions are kept safe by the freezing temperatures of those towers. Up here, where the air is hot and fetid, they become overheated and their du duality tears them asunder. As the other places flies from their cells and their vitae splinters, they live sporadically, torn from one world to the other and back again in violent, unpredictable bursts. For a few seconds they are creatures of this world, then they turn a then are torn away and cease to have physical form. This vicious ripping back and forth between worlds has driven them quite insane. I have ordered the affected areas sealed and will not allow my loyal workers to enter. These are damned places now. The ab Abode of failed experiments, ghosts of fear and spite. Eh? They're not going to. Okay. I guess. I was expecting a call. Every time that's shown up, there's been a call. Is there something in here I'm supposed to be doing? That I am. overlooking? This? don't think so. This is the thing. No. Oh, here we go. There we go. Fire the madness. Drain the waters. Open the way to the bilge pumps. We are waiting for you. I'm not sure how I feel about that, to be quite honest. Obviously can't go in there. It 
if there are invisible land things coming after me now, I'm not going to be impressed. Oh, okay, that's just closed. Great. Okay, let's go through a little section. This. Yes. Stay away, stay away, stay away, stay away, stay away. Jesus. I heard something up here. I heard something on the metal running. Here, this should be open. Yes. Uh. Jesus. Oh, hello. But we can save them. We can set them free. We can replace a rotten old world with a clean new one. Mr. Pettinus, you sound every bit the fanatic. Well, how can I be otherwise, Professor? How can any man of ethics simply stand by and watch this world drown in its own excrement? And your engineer, this visionary with whom you embarked upon this course, does he share your views? Indeed he does, indeed he does. The poor fellow has seen it all before. Now, this is not the first great civilization he has wept for. And so you set about things immediately upon your return. Naturally, naturally. These things cannot be left to rot upon the tree. And sponsors were remarkably easy to find. I tell you, Professor, a trail of greed brings rich men to your door like pigs to truffles. Pigs to truffles. I... have never had a truffle. I hear they're very expensive. And they don't necessarily... I do like mushrooms. Trouble's a type of fungus. I might like them. Uh, I think this is where I want to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's go up here. Great. I hate you all. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh, great, a maze. What? February 17th, 1899. And I said, look, my darlings, can you see it? And they said, yes, daddy, yes, we see it. A tall weathered cap of a steel-sided pyramid, so like these, those of Egypt. Stone falling away from the summit, vines crawling about, interwining the stucco serpents that thrive about the steps. A palpable sense of stillness, a weight of forgotten. And this, here, this is where we, the king sat. And this is where the priests lived, the house. This is the house of the dead, and here where the sun strikes. This is where they threw the hearts that were not consumed. No, my darlings, they most certainly were not savages. You see, they believed that the sky could fall on their heads, and tr they truly, truly believed that offering blood was the only way of stopping this from happening. Perhaps, my darling, perhaps they were mistaken altogether, or perhaps their tragedy was they could not spill blood enough to prevent the sky from falling in upon them. We will never know. Okay, what's over here? There's a piston. Got some of this stuff. Uh, that. Oh, here we go. There we go. So, this is probably gonna lock my right. Nope. Okay, let's... Okay. I was expecting... Was that always? Oh, yeah, here we go. Uh, let's check that new note. Mandis Post Sullivan. That's done it. Now I can enter the strange decontamination chamber once again and move upwards. 
The waters are pushed back, making the way to the bilge clear, where I can divert the remainder of this filthy torrent back into the Thames where it belongs and clear the path to the center of the machine. Uh, you can read that on your own if you'd like. Why do I feel like something's going to go horribly wrong during this? Ugh. Oh god. Uh, which was this, I believe. Yep. There we go. Close that. Get myself all cleaned off. And this time I truly need it. That is disgusting. I am so glad to be out of the sewers. And open this. Don't be anything behind there. Nope. Good. Wait. Okay. And I believe that will make an episode. Nice music to see us out. Uh, tune in next time to figure out what that's all about. Why is it getting louder? Okay, yeah. Thanks for watching. I've been your host, Giant Little Toe. Like and subscribe to show your support for this channel. Any questions, concerns, queries, conundrums? Put them down in the comment section below, and I will see you next time.